Hi there, this is the boomer. And this is whoever. You're the millennial. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So we're doing another review. This time it's a drink review. So this is the Royal Milk Tea. Now, if I was professional, I would have this loaded up on my phone to read the description. So uh, there's like, you can get like a single pack or like a 24 pack. Price-wise, the 24 pack is a pretty good deal because this was like seven bucks by itself. We uh the twenty four pack I think was like thirty so yeah if if even like I probably would suggest that even if you wanted to taste it the twenty four pack is probably a better deal. So this is a blend of black tea infused with milk. So yes, okay, we've had it in the fridge. Well, yeah, we're so close. I'm gonna do this because now I also wanted to give a heads up. Apparently, <laughs> um. There is a chance that it might be clumpy. Now, I don't know if that's just because, you know, it's just random chance because some of the viewers were talking about how it could be clumpy, it's not good, and it's obviously expensive. But they, apparently they fail to realize you can get a pack of 24 that's like only four times the price. So, well, did they shake it like I did? Well, Maybe it needs I, to be mixed. I don't know. Well, if I, if I were to click on... If this uh, comes out clumpy and smells like rotten milk, then I think... I mm, don't know if I want to drink it. Well, this is from Simply Goods INC, according to this. <laughs> now, if I... Or the brand is... Uh, Sa Sangaria? I, I hope that's how you say that. Yeah, if there is... Uh, here we go. Pack of 24 for $46. So you can get like 18 more of them. Should we should I pour? Yeah, open up. Oh yeah, new glasses by the way. Oh, look probably, at these, aren't these cool? Nice and square, like my brain they're, cells. They're like kind of like a diamond cut at the bottom. Isn't that cool? Oh, there is also a six pack for eighteen dollars. I'm trying to get the glasses lined up with the beverage, yeah, so we'll see. <laughs> you like that? Not annoying. That's so annoying. Stop. <laughs> All right, we'll see what's we'll see what happens here. Is it clumpy? Some squids come out. It doesn't look bad. It kind of looks like chocolate milk. It kind of looks like like a, a light coffee drink. Now, if we throw up afterwards, then are we I just was... are we gonna pour the whole sucker in there? Yeah. Why? Why? Okay. Why leave half? Like just in case we spit up. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's that. Oh, true. I don't think it's half and half. Oh. You want you want the higher one? Smells? Yeah, trying to, uh, uh, mm, we're such professionals. There we go. What did it say? Well, it was milk and like black tea or something? Black tea. Definitely smells like. How would you rate that? I guess a tea. Interesting. It tastes like um, a sweet pea. Hmm. Does it kind of taste like a sweet tea? Not much of a taste to it. I like it. Uh, seven dollars a can, though. I can't say. I don't like, like it for seven dollars a can. <laughs> I can't say go again. That's seven dollars a can. You can you can taste an aftertaste of tea. I would say to me, it's like a you put too much milk in your tea. You taste a lot of milk. Do you remember when we used to go to uh, what was what was it? Cracker Barrel? Mm -hmm. I think. Where their sweet tea was mm -hmm. like, they had those little packets. Mm -hmm. It tastes like that where you add a couple of those uh, sugar packets to it. I don't, to me, it's like, I get the aftertaste of tea. Same. You know what I mean? After I've drank it, then it can like, okay, I can taste the tea. It's good. I would get the 24 pack. It's, it's good. You can pay for the 24 pack. Um, <laughs> I will, damn it. <laughs> it is good. Uh, oh, I drank it. I would have more. It was pretty good. You want to finish mine? Not with your cooties in it. Girls, germs. Do <laughs> it. I pour some in your glass. No, it's fine. Um, it's it's kind of a a one percent milk with a with a tea aftertaste. The ingredients is water, milk, no shit, sugar, black tea. Really? There's milk and royal milk I tea. Know, right? Uh, Emulsifiers. I have no idea how to emulsifier. That. What is that? I don't know. Some shit uh, they put in there. So flavor, don't, black you know, tea bye -bye. leaves, and vitamin C. 
I drink it up all good. It's a product of Japan. I thought it was good. It's it's not bad. I mean, it's definitely something that I could see you having with breakfast. But I mean, it, it's like a the size of the can is like what will you get like a one dollar soda and it's seven bucks. Yeah, hundred and twenty calories in that too. Really? So we both had like sixty calories. Yeah, sixty calories and just like that like little it. little thing. It it was very good. Um, I wish there was a little bit more milk in it. I don't personally think it's worth the money. I could see maybe in a, maybe paying a couple bucks. I I don't think it's worth that. Two seventy five for one, maybe. That I could I could but handle that. At the same time, uh, this might, I mean this might be like a premium premium drink. Premium drink. I Hence mean, why it's seven bucks. I mean those freaking bottles of like juice that you get in the store are like six seven bucks. What juice? Well, if you want to get like papaya juice and pomegranate and all that kind of crap, they're expensive. Yeah, but it's probably a bigger can than but that. But to me, it's like <laughs> okay, if anybody knows one percent milk. There's like basically it tastes like milk with with well water with a little milk stirred See, in. I don't taste the milk. I, I like when you drink it, it just feels like a liquid, and then later you like taste the tea because of how it's yeah. a tea aftertaste. Yeah. I mean, it's it's definitely something I could see you having with breakfast. Yes. Ooh, yeah, that would be good. You know, have it have like, I could see you putting some extra coffee in there, <laughs> <laughs> using this as a Ooh, flavor to, to coffee. Yeah. Yeah, I could see that. I'll get the twenty four pack and make sure to tower it. <laughs> I don't have room in this house for all the shit you're buying as it is. Yeah, we have we have to have, we have to have a new house just to we buy do. all the milk tea. But, mm -hmm. but it's like, uh, okay, anybody out there who's listening, you know, to anybody listening, um, the five people that the watch, five, the five people that watch, <laughs> um, if you know, you know, obviously whole milk is, it's like rich and creamy and supposed to be really bad for you. And then you got your 2%, which is kind of in between. And then you got your 1%, which is what we have, um, which is, you know, just tastes like watered down 2%. And then you have skim. So I guess my would be skim, not 1%. Skim to me is like. Uh, milk or water with like a little couple drops of milk put in it. I mean, there's like hardly any milk flavor to it at all. It reminded me of skim milk and then you taste tea after you take a drink. What would you rate it? Scale one to ten? Yes. I'd give it like an eight. It, it's got a good flavor. I would. I want. I just think more. it's really expensive. I, I'm going to order more if I have to get the 24 back. But Money I have to give it a six just because of the price it's like seven bucks yeah. for that one can well i'm giving an eight for flavor if flavor? you're if you're, yes. if you're talking eight, flavor definitely. and price then yeah i do like a five or six because flavor definitely would it eight. definitely like i actually want expensive. another one but unfortunately we just have one <laughs> yeah we bought one because it's like what if we hate it you want a 24 pack and you hate it <laughs> uh -huh. but but yeah i was doing like eight for flavor but like if you took take the price eight and flavor for, in there then i would give it like a five because it's just too eight expensive for flavor but yeah if you combine the price you give it a six it's, it's not like, like one of those things uh, where you eat a piece of cheesecake and you're like oh i want so much more of this and i don't care if it's nine dollars you know a slice of cheesecake from the cheesecake factory is like a dollar more expensive than this yeah so, but that's something you just like that's uh, like 1400 calories you though. salivate over that. That's like an entire breakfast, lunch, and dinner in one go. Well, yeah, you just want to have a slice of, of cheesecake for the day. But yeah, um, it's it's definitely good, but very expensive. You can watch. We still have those gift cards. Yeah. Oh yeah, we have gift cards. So, anyways, I I uh, we'll put the link on the yes on the as video. well as the links for the glass. We'll do the glass for too. We think that we just seen these and thought, oh, that's like really uh, unique this, and cool. This isn't the last drink review. We actually have like uh, some Japanese sodas. Uh, we also have some sakura latte and oh, sakura cool. green tea. We also have something else. Oh yeah, some some other stuff. Isn't there like a uh uh karma? There's karma, and didn't we have like some sort of uh? Oh, you said that latte, didn't you? Yes. And we have like a little electric we teapot have we some can use. Special teapots that we can also showcase. Yeah, too. and we have some really cool teapots, and we've got some sake cups. We have all kinds of fun stuff that you guys can see, and we put the links for everything that you can buy on Amazon. Yep. On the uh, video. Yep. So you need to say anything else? No, that's pretty much it. I think that's I, it. I give it a six out of ten. If I would give it the eight out of ten if it was cheaper, but I thought it was good. Yeah, I would. I I'd say five or six out of ten too, just because of the price. Mm -hmm. See you in the next one. Uh...